what is good, Daily Xander, number 157, coming at you around 1-ish in the afternoon. To recap, last night, quite eventful with uh, everything going on at the festival, so, oh, so I'm just watching a soccer game right now in Miami Beach. Getting my son on. Uh, yeah, to recap, uh, been full of music for sure. Big crowd, lots of people. Enjoyed it, big time, great atmosphere. My uh, storage got pretty low, so I wasn't really able to do much commentary. Uh, however, you did see uh, what I captured. Uh, the DJ set, I mainly, for the most part, was at the main stage. Most of the footage was shot in the large stage. Of course, there's about seven or eight different stages, so can't speak to how uh, how big the festival is. It's pretty big for what all they have to offer, and there's always music being played and such. Um, and really, the amount of people there, there's about at least 88 to 90 probably countries represented, uh, people that showed up. That's what they announced, but could probably be even more. But uh, it's quite the diverse crowd, so it's really cool to be a part of that. And even just being in Miami, at least in the part Miami Beach and then the downtown area, it really is quite diverse. And uh, English doesn't really seem like the main language a lot of times, so it's cool. I like it. I like a lot different, different environment, that is for sure. I was able to get a solid nine hours of sleep or so. I was up until, I didn't get back until like 2.30 or so in the morning. uh, Because I actually, I got a ride. I got a ride when I was crossing that Venetian Bridge yesterday. Uh, People were just asking if I was going to Miami Beach and they offered. And I got a free ride, so that was cool. So I got back a little early, so I decided to go down to uh, Miami Beach where all uh, the clubs are and check them out. So it was cool. Definitely a, a lot more different than Orlando and other places I've been. Just the energy is uh, it seems twenty four seven really. Like um, I mean that's that's why Miami is known for uh, it's a big time party city and uh, lots of flashiness. That's for sure. Lots of distractions also. But uh, if you're grounded and you keep your mind uh, mind focused for the most part. Uh, You'll be fine, but it's really cool. I really like Miami. Uh, the attractiveness on the women's scale, definitely a 10. <laughs> For uh, who's all here, so yeah. Game plan for today. Uh, another easy day. I'm liking this weekend, man. I'm liking it a lot. It's just a nice, uh, I know I'm doing stuff, but it's nice and relaxing for me um, to go along with them, seeing new stuff. I'm just uh, I'm just listening to my body, so I go to sleep and I get up whenever my body tells me to get up, and don't have to feel rushed. I can pretty much do whatever I want, so I'm liking that. I can show up to anything right now, and uh, I like it for a music festival. So probably won't go until another three or four, maybe five hours from now. This doesn't get over till midnight, so I might just wait. Right now, I'm just enjoying the the sun. Nice beach breeze. Oh, there's another thing I was going to say. It started raining around like 8 last night, like downpouring. So I I was out there for a bit, and then I actually chilled uh, the closest place where it wasn't super crowded to uh, have a cover, a roof on top of you. It was a porta potty, so it was actually in the porta potty for a good solid almost hour just because it was raining so hard, and I wanted to stay dry. Uh, But then it got really muddy afterwards, but it was all good. Um, so I got back out and it was really fun and enjoyable so I, I enjoy, uh, enjoy my time and I continue to enjoy my time so keep with it keep going uh, new experiences yes sir Bob Daily Xander number 157 these are flying by for me let's keep the process going keep focused keep building good habits keep this accountability project as a growth tool for me and not something that I'm just doing just just to uh, manage to get 
this gold mine and also get some value out of it, get value out of it, I like to say. So on that note, I'm gonna continue working on some handsets. I'll probably do some push-ups and uh, I'm gonna find another uh, park space. Because right now this space is occupied, but there's some uh, there's some places else, elsewhere that I noticed yesterday when I was walking. So on that note, I'll catch you in another update. Peace. Yo, what is good, Z Nation? Daily Zero number one, five, seven, coming at you as I wait for my Uber. Pretty interesting. I got a message saying uh, my Uber driver. I've never seen this before. Uber driver is deaf or hard of he hearing. So I found that pretty interesting. That um, I just found that pretty interesting. I get a message, and uh, I mean, it makes sense. Why not? Uh, why would you discriminate? I guess against somebody that has a hard time hearing or is completely deaf as a driver, so. It does uh, bring about some uh, liability issues, I'm sure, as far as I like, can't hear sirens or just can't hear uh, surroundings when you're driving that would make you a good defensive driver, that's for sure. Good day so far. Got a good amount of sun. Did a workout at a park with some pull-up bars, so that was, that was cool. I know, I'm, I think I'm gonna try tomorrow. I didn't do it like I said I was going to because I actually slept in. Since my flight tomorrow's on until like 3.30 in the afternoon, I'm gonna head to the beach around 10 or 11 so I can get some sun before I actually go to the airport. So uh, that's the plan for tomorrow. And yeah, just continue uh, enjoying the night. I think after the festival gets over, I'm gonna do uh, some walking around the actual downtown area because I haven't done much of that. It's pretty cool, so where the park's at, festival's at. It's right next to American Airlines Arena, so that's where Miami Heat play. And there's just like a whole, whole host of different different neat buildings and stuff. Architecture is really cool. Uh, I definitely say it's a mix of obviously your modern, contemporary, kind of find other big cities in the U.S., but it has a lot of Caribbean feel to it or what would that be? I guess the Spanish, Spanish. You, know, you see a lot of that tile for roofing and stuff like that. But yeah, that's about uh, all I can tell you. <coughs> I'm 
I keep saying, definitely hear way more uh, other languages than English. So, big fan of that. Big fan of that. All right, I'll uh, check in with you a little later. I'm gonna try and do more footage today besides uh, just showing you the festival. I'll have some of my own face showing up in the festival itself. So, gotta do it. All right, check in with you a little later. Keep staying positive, learning, unique and respectful. That's a plur, different plur though. Catch you later. Peace.